Hi hello welcome i'm happy to be here with another interesting clip for uh, ir advanced firmware update which is automatically no manual intervention so let's begin how to do that in order to do online update first of all your machine should have an internet access make sure you have right internet access so this clip we are going to discuss two different methods the one is through service mode the second one is through user customer admin mode so for the service mode update uh, first you'll have to check what is your current firmware for the get to service mode go to copier and display and you can see that dccon and uh, all these are the current firmware which is available in the device so it's good to note check what firmware is available then go to updater and click update firmware so this is the method which will help you to do update to service mode so when i click applicable firmware so it it brings me the list of numbers list of firmware so this is service mode even you can allow the customer admin to update the firmware without entering the service mode so for that you'll have to go to system and settings and device settings and management settings and uh, license and others uh, under here you have to have registered and update the software so click update firmware so click new firmware by the time this device will check the available firmware from the internet through uh, they have called cds content delivery system so when you click next you can update now or you can set a time also you can update uh, your email address so as soon as the firmware get updated you will be notified the status of it so i have given my number my details and click agree then wait for the machine to respond now the firmware has been downloaded it will start update when you click apply firmware so there is a two process now we are applying a firmware which is uh, updating into your your machine so the same time when you have a look on the when device also you can identify the control panel is responding and there is a um, updates going on so wait for the machine to reboot it reboots several times whenever uh, each firmware gets updated it keeps rebooting make sure you have you do not you should not have the power interruption you should not have the internet interruption because it's downloaded and uh, installing automatic so yeah once it's updated automatically it'll on if you like this clip and thanks for watching